Do you want to sell your LearnDash courses by using the shortcut and offer your user a multiple payments plan like the one-time payment, a recurring subscriptions, and the payment installment? Shortcut is a brand new way to sell your LearnDash courses. Previously, a lot of the LearnDash users are either using the PayPal, Stripe, or the WooCommerce, and they have a complete monopoly over the LearnDash. Now, the Shortcut actually offers a lot of better ways to sell your LearnDash courses, and probably I'm sure that it is going to replace the WooCommerce in a future, especially for the courses, because in the WooCommerce, you have to pay a lot of money for the add-ons. For example, if you want to buy the the WooCommerce subscriptions and the WooCommerce memberships and things like that. So Shortcut have completely revolutionized the process. My name is Mubashir Taki and in this video I'm going to show you that how Shortcut is the best way to sell your courses right now. So let's just get started with the Shortcut. So the first thing we need to do is need to actually install the Shortcut plugin and the LearnDash plugin. So I have already installed the LearnDash plugin and added a few courses. Now, for the first thing we need to do is to add a new product. So, we're going to name the product the same as we have a course. Let's go to the Learn Dash courses. So, for example, I want to sell this course, Seek Health with the Yoga Sadhana. I will copy that name, paste it here as a URL, and create a new product. So, this is where the magic happens. You have a multiple payment options to add. For example, let me show you. The first thing we need, we can actually add a one-time payment. For example, I'm offering a $60 as a one-time payment. So let's just create that. Now add the another payment option, which is the payment plan. For example, I want to offer a $20 of one payment for each month for the next three months. Let's just create that. Now we have to add the one last option, which is the monthly subscription. And monthly subscription price is $10 and it repeats every month. And I can also offer the trial and I also allow the user to whatever they want. But I'm not going to choose that option. I will just simply create this price. The pricing model is really important in the shortcut. This is where you completely replace the WooCommerce because WooCommerce does not actually allow us to do that unless you buy their extension or buy their add-on. Now let's just come down to the integration and this is the point where I need to tell that which my course is going to get access after I purchase this product. So let me choose the integration. Let's go to courses, choose the course, seek out the yoga sadhana and add an integration. And that's it. Our product is created. The last step is to add a product image. I'm going to choose this image and save the product. So now my product is created, only two steps remains. The now first thing we need to do is to go to the forums and create a checkout forum. And the last step is to go to the courses and put the forum URL into the course. So let's just go to the forums and create our new forum. Click on add new. I'm going to name the forum the course checkout. I have also multiple templates to choose. Uh, for example, the single layout the two columns and default and many others but i'm going to choose the really simple one the first one so i will just click here the next add a product so every month add a product <laughs> every three months and a one-time payment as well and now i can actually enable the thank you page as well my thank you page is already created i just need to select here now we'll go back here in the product option. It says the customer must purchase all of these options. We don't want that. We're going to choose the middle one. The customer must select one of these options. So that is really important. I will just click here at create. In the course checkout option, I need to select my payment method is a PayPal. I have all these three options available. I can also add a coupon. You can add and delete any of these things by clicking here and choose if you want, if you need to add any of these things. Okay. Just simply create and uh, our forum is created. Now just simply publish this. Make sure your forum is live, not in a testing mode and just create, uh, click on a publish. So our forum is published. I will go back my to my dashboard page. Now our forum is published. We have to paste this forum to elsewhere. So we have a shortcut for that. I'm going to here create a new page. 
So you can actually create a landing page for the uh, user and actually paste this uh, code there. Name the page course landing. Paste the short code we have copied. Say short code and publish this short code. Now first view this page. Okay, now we have three options available. The first one is uh, $10 a month. This one, the yoga sadhana, and this one is a $60 a one-time payment. I can also choose my credit card and my PayPal as well. So what I need to do is to actually copy this page URL, go back to my courses, my course is closed, click on edit, go to the settings, Go to the close, give a price of a $60 and paste the URL here and update the course. That's it. Now you will be able to sell your course through the shortcut. Let me copy this page and test a user. We go to incognito window. I'm going to click take the course. Take this course. Now we have a multiple payment option. I'm going to choose this one. I have a coupon code. I noticed the one bug in this shortcut. I'm not sure what the shortcut team is updating or not. But when I choose my single product, it says, please contact us for the payment. I'm not sure why it is saying that. But again, it is when I select the one time payment, it says that, okay, choose a PayPal or either choose a credit card. I will let you know after the video in a comment that either this was the bug or this was the thing that I need to fix. Okay, I will contact with the shortcut team as well. But for the moment, let's just get started and choose this plan and choose my name, set a password and set an email address and add a coupon code I have, 100 of. So my coupon code is applied. What I need to do is just simply click here check out and that's it my thank you page my order is processed let's just go to manage the orders so you see i need to actually log in i need to actually enter the email address and the password i choose but what i do what i'll do i'll go to my inbox and check the emails that i got Here are the two emails that I got the thank you for your orders, view the order details. I'll copy the URL and paste in incognito window and it will automatically, it should automatically take me to the dashboard page, get login and take me to the dashboard page because they have coupon involved, or okay, token involved. So yes, it is taking me to the dashboard page, but let's go to the course in and see that am I enrolled to this course or not? Okay, yes, see, I'm actually enrolled. My other course is $10, this one was free, this one is here. Let's just click on a continue, go down, get started, and just start the lesson. So this is how you can actually sell your course by using the shortcut and offering a multiple payment plan. But as you can see, I have noticed the one thing um, in, in the checkout process that it says, uh, when I choose another plan, it says contact your team. But I'm not sure that is this bug, but I'm going to contact the sport and let you know in the comment section as well. Also, if I miss something or um, if you have any question or suggestion, please do let me know in the comment section and please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm new on YouTube and this will really help me a lot. Thank you so much.